Hi, this is Jeff Haynes with Mike Through Common Sense. I just wanted to make a quick video because today's been a really depressing day with the whole Donald Trump and the Freedom Coalition thing. And I just want to share some of my thoughts. President Trump, you are wrong, and the Freedom Coalition is right. The health care bill that you wanted to pass with your rhino buddies was a bad bill. And now that that bill didn't pass, it's just like, well, that's it. There ain't going to be no health care reform now because you guys wouldn't take what we wanted to give you. And, uh, and it's an either-or proposition. You know, President Trump, before you got into office, uh, the Republican Congress passed, what, 60 bills repealing Obamacare? and even got some of them to Obama's desk, knowing that they would be rejected by Obama, vetoed by Obama. Now that you could repeal it, they're giving this bill that all it does is fix Obamacare and really doesn't do anything to change all the bad things about Obamacare. And if we don't like that bill, then that's just it, and you have to take it or leave it. You know, I didn't vote for you originally. I voted for Ted Cruz in the primaries. But after you were the nominee, I've grown to like you more and more and more. And uh, you're letting this rhino Congress ride roughshod over you. They're screwing you over. A bad bill is a bad bill. It doesn't matter if it was the original Obamacare bill or this rhino bill. A bad bill is a bad bill. You promised to drain the swamp. The problem is, is that if you've ever actually walked into a swamp, you can step into it and if there's quicksand or something there, it can suck you down. And I think it's already sucking you down. It's going to be April now and Obamacare is still in force. My wife and I still have to pay a $1,500 fine this year on top of last year's $900 or $800 and years before is $200. Money we don't have. I voted for to send you to Washington for um, a few things and none of it's getting done. I mean, I want you to repeal Obamacare. I wanted you to uh, fix taxes. I wanted you to deal with the... Uh, Illegal immigrants, build the wall, get illegals out of the country, and I want you to deal with Islamic terrorism. And instead, yesterday, you're promoting this anti-drug thing now. To be honest with you, I don't care if some moronic idiot kills himself with heroin. I just don't care. That's not my concern. Stop with these petty side issues, this garbage side issues, and do what we elected you to do. I still love you, but I'm telling you, piss off conservatives and you won't get reelected. Because without us conservatives, you're not going to be president in four years from now. You need us. A lot of them voted for you to vote against Hillary. And if you mess up, those people aren't going to vote for you. They stayed home for Romney. You know, they stayed home for Bob Dole. You know, it's just the way conservatives are. They're really fickle. Don't you be fickle. Do what you promised us to do. Make those rhino bastards in Congress repeal Obamacare. We sent you to the presidency not to fix Obamacare, not what this bill tried to do, we sent you there to repeal Obamacare. Please do what we need you to do. My wife and I financially aren't making it. It's all because of the government interference in our lives. We want it to end. We want government out of our lives. And it needs to start with Obamacare. It needs to end. Everyone who's been fined and screwed out of money by this monstrosity needs to have that money refunded to them. And it needs to be made right. And we need you to make the Rhino Congress do it. 
please. This is Jeff Haynes with Mike Through Common Sense. Uh, subscribe underneath. It's just not good enough to subscribe. You have to subscribe and then you have to hit the bell or else you won't get notifications of my new videos. We'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.